Today, you see where Chamber is going to give you a quick potato update. So, last week, a few weeks ago, we planted potatoes, and as you can tell, they're coming up very nicely. Um, I'm very happy with how they're coming up. Um, I'll link in the video there up top of, of how we went the process through uh, planting potatoes. Um, they're all coming up really nicely. Um, I'm waiting to um, all of them are up to go ahead and molt. Just uh, the potatoes don't get the benefit of having landscape fabric over top of them. That helps preserve moisture. Uh, so we'll have to do some heavy mulching on this side just to keep weeds out of the way. But as you can tell, they're they're up and they're doing pretty well. I'm pretty co content with how they're coming so far. Um, and that's my attempt to begin mulching. As you can tell, weed seeds are coming up because I had to dig that trench. And once I dug the trench, I brought weed seeds up to the top of the soil. So it is what it is. I'm not too con too concerned about it. Once we mulch heavy, it should um, should help us combat and fight the weeds. I'm just worried about any ma major grasses directly competing. Any grasses on the fringe, I feel like we'll have an we'll be able to knock them back. But they look beautiful, man. And it didn't take very long. So if you're thinking about planting potatoes, I think that's the way to go, man. Just uh, take your time. Remember, we're gonna link in the video up top of um, how we did it. Everyone has a different method, but it's pretty much all the same. Um, that's pretty much it. I just want to give you a quick potato update. We'll have more videos coming out this weekend. We got lots of stuff to do. We got plants to put in the ground. Uh, seeds need to go down. Holes in the plants need to be burned. Uh, drip irrigation system needs to be finished. And that's a whole lot of stuff. And that's a whole lot of videos. That's a whole lot of time. But um, that's pretty much it for today, guys. I thank you so much for watching. I thank you for the uh, new subscribers that came over from uh, our Instagram. Follow us on Instagram now. We're um, Chain Breakers Garden. You can find us there. We only got like 10 photos because my Instagram game is uh, brand new. So, But thank you for following us. Uh, once again, this continues to be our most watched uh, month so far. Uh, each each week, we continue to build more and more views. You guys are, you know, our subscribers are, you know, we got a, we got a nice little core of subscribers. Um, but a lot of people aren't subscribing; they're just viewing. And hey, don't worry about it. Hey, you you go ahead and put a ring on. You don't have to be too scared. Um, you know, you, this is YouTube is not monogamous. We don't have to be your only garden, your only garden channel. Like there are plenty of other great ones out there. Lead Farmer and Chain, uh, oh, I said Chain Breakers, Lead Farmer and Jersey, Jersey Outdoors and Just Sadden and uh, you know, and the list goes on and on and on and on and uh, uh, Homestead Heart, all these great, you, you, that's great, they're great. But you can put a ring on us too. You know, it won't be cheap. You know what I'm saying? But for all that, I thank you so much for watching. I thank you guys for so much for t uh, liking, subscribing, and sharing. Um, we're, we're really, I'm really, really happy with and uh, our progress that we're making so far. Um, so that's potatoes 101. Remember, we'll share the video on how we did it, and then we'll have new videos coming up of our irrigation system and all the other stuff that that entails. So until next time, we'll get it again some other time, guys. Thank you.